Full disclosure, I started cooking about 10 years ago. And when people used to tell me that they felt like, you know, cooking was therapy or they would relax while cooking, I thought, what is wrong with you? Something has to be. I never could have imagined cooking being a favorite pastime of mine, but it really is, and I enjoy it so much. So over the weekend, I had a very special sous chef in town. My cousin Erica came in. She also loves to cook. So we tried out a recipe that I found online from one of my favorite chefs, the Barefoot Contessa, Ina Garden. She had, and I don't even know how to pronounce it, but I knew it was going to taste good just because it's the Barefoot Contessa. It's Coquille Saint-Jacques. It's um, scallops with cheese, with heaven, and believe it or not, I pulled it off. Take a look. Hey, Tam fam, welcome to Cooking with Tam from my home. Well, what I'm cooking today is Coquilles Saint-Jacques. And I don't know if I'm pronouncing it. It's a French preparation of scallops in a creamy sauce under a bread crumb and cheese um, heaven ball, I guess. <laughs> Uh, my cousin Erica is here with me. This is something we love to do, cooking together. I love something new and stepping out of my comfort zone. So here we go. The recipe calls for shallots. One of my weaknesses in the kitchen is chopping. I know my chop game is not great. Next up, a full cup of cream, 12 ounces of mushrooms cleaned, which my cousin Erica did, stem, and sliced. I didn't start eating mushrooms until I was probably in my 30s, but I love them now. So I love that this recipe calls for mushrooms. So we're doing fresh breadcrumbs as the recipe calls for. Five ounces of Gruyere cheese. Delicious. And now we're starting our sauce, which asks for us to warm butter. Next, quarter cup of flour. Whisking that in. Now adding a fourth of a teaspoon of curry, teaspoon and a half of salt, and half a teaspoon of pepper. And now we're gonna let this simmer for 10 minutes. Our cream sauce is pretty much done. Now I'm adding the shallots. We'll cook these up nice and beautifully. Then we're gonna add the mushrooms. Oh, yes, this is the tamarind hall. Let's talk about it. Spatula. These are our base scallops. They are absolutely beautiful. They smell amazing. And in a minute, they'll be in the oven. Topping it with the breadcrumbs and parsley in combination for the crunchy finale. Here we are. Beautiful. So that was inside my actual kitchen at home. Ina's scallop dish did not disappoint. I, I was so excited about it, to be honest with you. I forgot to take a picture of the actual finished product. So you saw it just out of the oven, and after that, it was all gone. So thank you to the Barefoot Contessa for creating another amazing recipe.